Welcome to sunny Fort Myers, Florida and JetBlue Park, the spring training home of the Boston Red Sox for our daily Mass Live spring training video diary. And right out of the chute this morning, there was news here as colleague Chris Cotillo reported that the Red Sox and Brian Bayo were making progress on a long-term extension. Now, earlier in the week, there was news and word that Tristan Casas had also been offered an extension, which he summarily turned down, saying it wasn't enticing enough. This one seems a little bit closer to the finish line, as Brian Bayo told Chris Cotillo when asked whether there was a chance of this getting done before the end of spring training, he said in Spanish, more or less. So there seems to be momentum toward getting Brian Bayo locked up long term. And that would be a big piece of news for the Red Sox. They have made it known they want to make this a priority with some young homegrown players to sort of mimic that Atlanta Braves model of getting guys locked up buying out some free agent years and creating some continuity and stability in the system. On the field today, a couple of live batting practice sessions for both Nick Pavetta and Tanner Houck. Manager Alex Cora said both looked good. Seems as if the Red Sox are having their pitchers do a little bit more a little earlier this year to get ready. Coming up this weekend is the start of Grapefruit League play. First on Friday, it's the annual exhibition game against Northeastern. A lot of relievers will be taking those innings. And then on Saturday, when the Red Sox make their first Grapefruit League game debut against the Baltimore Orioles in Sarasota, it will be Garrett Whitlock getting some time on the mound. We'll update a little bit more on the pitching schedule tomorrow.